guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, we are going to go down and listen to a few of T Ronnie's songs from the new album that he does not have videos to. I think there's three of them, Lacey said. Mm -hmm. So yep. we're yep. going to do I that got my, uh, today. I got my CD. I got this yesterday. And I got a shirt. Look yeah. at that. Lacey's Ronnie's over there shot. subscribing to his Patreon and getting all the yeah. joys of Ronnie Hood over there. So. Well, this this was from the pre order a long months and months and months and months ago, a uh, long time ago. Uh, but Still it jealous. only came, it it only came out when uh, the album dropped on Friday, so I finally got it. But I ordered it like I swear three months ago. <laughs> yeah, or it felt like three months ago at least. It was a while back. Uh, I'm excited though. It's the yeah, only, only three yeah. songs we haven't heard yet. I yes, mean, she, off his album. And, and Lacey has not opened her CD. If you've seen it, it was still in the mm -hmm. package, so she has not heard them. So we nope, were doing I, I this together. specifically have been avoiding listening to these, and it's been torture. So Don't here we are. Are you ladies especially, ready? Yeah, oh. especially this one, because oh, yeah. Rhea, his girlfriend, is featured on it. I'm excited Which is, I didn't that. even know she could sing. I didn't either. Who knew? Okay. I can't wait. Let's go. Yay! I'm the bad guy. I'm a savage. I'm obsessive. I'm dramatic. I'm a loner. I'm an addict. I'm so goddamn problematic. I'm the bad guy. I'm a loser. I'm a psycho. Believe the rumors. I got bad thoughts. I got bad vibes. I don't act right. It's nice to meet you. Cause I'm the bad guy. I got baggage. I am fucked up. I am damaged. My opinions are offended. I'm an asshole. Brought me back a little bit to his older music. Me too. But, but, but wait, so, yeah. No, so, yeah. And so that's what's so funny. Like, I know. I didn't hate. I didn't hate it. But she's not a fan but of. She didn't love it. I didn't love it. Yeah. <laughs> but no, I, I like, love it. I, I liked. I liked that. I, I liked that certain part, like when, like um, that chorus, like the bridge changed. or whatever. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. I know. I know but, why yeah, you didn't like. It. I know exactly why you didn't like it. Ronnie has so many layers in his voice that he usually uses almost every layer here lately in his music, and you're missing that because he went with his rappy rap a little bit, and it's like I guess um, uh, what's it called? Um, more alternative. It was more alternative than it was like the the rock in the rap. Yeah, I don't know. I didn't hate it, but like out of the whole album, 
Yeah, not Definitely my favorite. Not, not my like, favorite. Not my favorite. But yeah. we still have two more to hear, guys. So, but I would yeah. still look. I would still buy this album and still love every fucking song on it, including this one. It's just, and I would let it play. I just, it wasn't my favorite of the album so far. Yeah, well, I definitely love Ronnie when he raps. Like, I just, I love my rap shit, you know? I love rap. But I also and love, see, I, I love, love, but I, I grew, like, a big part of my life was listening to music that was, like, in that t- same kind of genre, that kind of, like, emo, punk, uh, pop, kind of, like, rock alternative sound. It's hard to, you know, but I more so, I love the, the idea of the song, like, because the funny thing is, Ronnie isn't a bad guy, but everybody says that he is, yeah. and I, you know, I see it all the time on his socials, like, he's lost uh, two uh, freaking Instagrams now, because all, all because he's just defending himself against people who are talking shit about him. The like, people those people get away hurt. with it, yeah. but everybody paints him out to be the bad guy, and it's kind of like, He's just like, this is, you know, the, I'm the bad guy. I'm, you know, the loser. Like, all the shit that people say about him. And, like, he's actually none of those things. But right. that's what people say he is. And, uh, and see, and I, and I like it when Ronnie goes into his dark, his dark growl. And, like, the metal, mm-hmm. the metal side of Ronnie is what I really prefer. I mean, I like his rappy rap shit, too. When he, especially when he mixes it with that. Yeah. That rock. Uh, the, um, the metal. The metalness in his voice. I love it. Yeah, and, and I guess I, I was uh, kind of missing. I mean, he had a little bit of it, but not, not what I'm used to. Yeah. So this is one of those songs that like I connect more. Like I just love the, the song itself. Like, and you're right, Carol. The the bridge is freaking dope. Like that that layers mm-hmm. uh, the layers of his voice going into the chorus. There is just really freaking dope. It's just super catchy. But I mean, uh, Ronnie doesn't write bad hooks. Like Ronnie is one of the best hook writers ever. And like, I think literally the more so. Carol and I hear the song, the more and more will it'll grow on us too. Yeah, well, there's there's some songs that do that, like that I've heard that I wasn't like really big on at first, and then you know, all of a sudden I listen to it a couple of times, and I'm like, oh, okay, well I kind of like that, or I kind of like this, and then it does grow on you, and then there's other songs that I'm but, just like, I'm never gonna like this song no matter what I do. <laughs> the, the one that we reacted to the other night, um, uh, uh, prequel, when we reacted oh, yeah. to it, okay, like I've been listening to it pretty much on repeat lately, and there was a lot of things I didn't catch when we first watched or listened to it. And then somebody yeah. in the comment section was like, "Y'all missed this bar," but then I went and looked at your uh, reaction to it the other day, last night, and you caught it there. It was about the the part about his uh, other band that he kind of gave him a shout out. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah escape the fate. But see, oh, well, and he like he really did escape his fate. He also mm-hmm. escaped the fate he was with that band, in, and then he escaped. Uh, well, and then the band escaped. The in fate. my so it's defense, like a I never really. Okay, y'all might have told me the name before, but like I didn't really. It didn't click, you know, like because yeah. like I never heard his music until Falling in Reverse, and it was until yeah. the older this this kind of Falling in Reverse, not. I think Voices in My Head was my, was my first song for Falling in Reverse. Yeah, I, I've done a couple, uh, one or two Escape the Fate songs, so, like, that's why. And then, um, uh, but if anybody is curious, he did put the lyrics in the, uh, I found it afterwards, in the description. Okay. The lyrics, if you scroll all the way down, the, the lyrics to the whole song are in there, which is nice. Uh, uh, I love that he does it's that. It's actually um, here, too. Oh, yeah, see, there you go. Okay. Yeah, I guess he he puts lyrics the lyrics all in all of his. Uh, I'm a music, bad guy. I'm pretty sure. I'm a savage. I'm obsessive. Yeah. I'm dramatic. I'm a loner. I, I no, I feel those lyrics. I do. Yeah. No. It's. I mean, you know, I'm so goddamn problematic. Like everything mm. he does, and like, and he's not just like he also is kind of a problem to himself because he's he suffers with mental health a lot. Of, uh, I mean, just like so many of us, you mm-hmm. know. Uh, I'm a psycho. Believe the rumors. Like that, that's what he's saying. Like. You know, yeah, you just believe anything anybody says about him. Like, people will just take other people at their word. Like, mm-hmm. like that's obviously the complete truth instead of just, like, looking it up themselves. Like, or I can't count how many times people have said something to me. With your own opinion about them. Like, yeah. that's something that, that's big in my life. Like, I, I get people who believe the rumors and not really get to know me as a person and just judge me off of what they heard. I'm like, I stick to myself. Like, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> yeah and then i mean i've just i've seen i've seen so many things that he's responded to i've seen shit in the comments i've seen people comment on stuff about him that somebody else posted like right. it's just uh it's funny how shitty people can be on the internet what mike tyson said it the best he said uh 
people have gotten too comfortable talking shit online and not getting punched in the face for it. Yep. That. Like, that's so true. Yep. So, yeah, but that was good. I can't wait to hear the, the other two. The comment section in ours is sometimes like that. I just, mm. people wild. Yep. Wild. Yep. So, all right. Welcome. So we got, we got, uh, we're kind of like almost like a one to two on this song. Like, I think I loved it. <laughs> Mel said it was okay. It was pretty good. Carol's a little, ah, meh. I can yeah. take it or leave it. Because I, <laughs> I like you the know. lyrics. So I think once I listen to it some more, it'll it'll click. Yeah. And don't anybody I, out there get it twisted. I absolutely love Falling Reverse. Just okay. know that. She's, She's the fan. one who introduced me to Falling yeah. Reverse. Okay? Uh, so do not come for Carol. Don't, because don't if come you come for, for my friends, I will come for you. Okay? <laughs> don't come for me. I've just... It's just a preference yeah. at this one right and, and now. Do you want us to be it's real or do you want us favorite. to be fake? That's what you need to ask because we're being real okay, right like, now. I'm the female Ronnie. I will come for you. I'm not playing. <laughs> so please oh. keep it civil and nice. Constructive criticism is welcome as long as you're not bringing that little dick energy. Right. Along with it. Right. <laughs> and with that being said, uh, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Hit that bell if you want to get notified anytime that Betty's drop. And uh, if you want to help support the channel, those will be linked um, in the description below as well. And until next time, guys, stay tuned for some more uh, Falling Reverse. Roddy Radke, peace out.